Hi, my name is Jamie Pence from Video Bread, and we recently got our hands on Skybox Studio V2, and it is a game changer. Um, one of the favorite things about this new release to me is the Composer tool, and it's fundamentally going to change the way we work with VR footage and After Effects. And playing around with the Composer tool, I first noticed how easy it's going to be to get rid of rigs. You know, rig removal is going to be so fast now with Composer compared to, you know, the old days. And when I say the old days, I'm talking about like a week ago uh, before Skybox Studio V2 uh, was released with its new Composer tool. Uh, so what I'd like to do first is to, is to show you how long it used to take in the old days and how fast it is now with the Composer tool. Um, here is some footage we shot over the summer at Kentucky Kingdom. Uh, and if you look here, uh, we shot this with our six rig and there is our rig that we need to get rid of. And what I'd like to do now is to show you uh, how long it used to take in the old days. So, that's how long it used to take to get rid of a rig. And, you know, like I said, when I first started playing with Composer, uh, I was amazed on how fast you can get rid of a rig. So now I'd like to show you how fast it is with Skybox uh, V2 Composer. So to launch uh, Skybox V2 Composer, what you do is you go to your window icon up here and you select Skybox Composer. And once you select that, it comes up over here in your in your tabs. And so the first thing we want to do is we want to take this extra rectangular footage and we want to add a 2D edit to it. So we're going to click Add 2D Edit. We're going to select our comp, and our comp width is 4096. And then we're going to hit Add 2D Edit. And look at what the magic of Metal and Composer does. It takes that extra rectangular footage and it puts it into a format that, you know, us After Effects guys and gals are more used to, to using. Look at that. You can, you can pan, you can move around. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to go down here and we're going to look at our rig. And the cool thing is at any point in time, if you want to look at your output and your, your output render, you just open output render and you look at that and there's your echo rectangular footage. So we're going to go back to our first edit. We're going to select that. And there is our rig that we want to get rid of. And so we're just going to move this over a little bit here. And let's go. So we're just going to duplicate this layer. And we're going to grab some grass over here. And we're just going to move it over that rig. And the thing I love about the thing I love about Composer is it really lets you have sort of a traditional After Effects approach to VR problems. Um, so we're going to feather this out, and we're going to go back to our open output render and look at that. <laughs> we're going to load this up here and. The rig is gone. Did you hear that? That is a geek mic drop. Um, so you see how easy it's going to be to get rid of rigs. And, you know, the cool thing is, you know, let's say, for example, we just wanted to add some text down there or like a like a, an icon of which way you should be looking at. It's so simple. So we're going to go back to our edit. And I'm just going to do a new solid here. And that's the great thing is you can do everything now in After Effects. There's no more jumping back and forth to Photoshop. Um, so let's just do this here real quick. My bad. Let's take the transparency down somewhat. And let's say we want our folks to be looking that way. So let's just add some little graphics here. Let's add like a little icon here. It is so super cool 
now that you can just do all of this uh, inside Composer. Uh, I mean, I guess you could subcomp this if you wanted to, then bring it in. But the ability to be able to do this stuff right on your footage uh, and then at any point look at it in your output option, you know, is pretty crazy. And, you know, I, I really think it's a game changer. Now let's look at our output render. And look, it's already added it. And we did that really, really quick. Um, so you can see how fast it is now to do things in Composer. So I know what you're thinking. That was an extremely easy rig to get rid of. What if you have something that's a little bit more complex? And that's what I love about Composer. Uh, here's a shot that we did for the Kentucky Center of the Arts in Louisville. And let me show you here. I'm going to go ahead and add this to Composer. We'll select our comp. Our comp width is 4096. And if you look down here, there's our rig. And, you know, I guess we could take a mask and just throw over that. Um, but I think it needs a little bit more work than that. So the great thing about Skybox Composer is we can use After Effects tools within this comp. So uh, we're going to open this layer up and we're going to use the After Effects cloning tool right within Composer. It's just so amazing you can do this inside Composer uh, without going out, you know, to After Effects or whatever. Um, you know, Composer is my favorite part of Skybox Studio V2. And, you know, I don't want to leave out some of my other favorite tools for Metal. And one is called the Post Effects Series. And, you know, if you're doing a lot of six camera and two camera rig stuff, you'll notice that, you know, obviously the two camera rig looks soft. And... Uh, in Metal's post effects series, they have a tool called Sharpen, and it is one of the best Sharpen tools I've ever seen. And I've been using After Effects for a long time. And you apply that puppy on some two camera rig footage, and it really, really brings out the detail. It's a really amazing tool. And there is a quick rig removal. So let's look at our output, and the rig is gone. You know, I could have spent more time on that, but I mean, look how quick that is. Pretty amazing, isn't it? And, you know, if you look down here, no more rig. You know, we could throw some type there or whatever. Um, and there's so many other things you can do with Composer. Uh, my friend Jonathan Wimbush from Wimbush TV has showed you how you can track uh, with Composer. And uh, I think, you know, once again, there's so many things we're going to be figuring out with Composer, and I'm really excited about it. Uh, but just for me, as far as, you know, quick rig removal and things like that, adding text really quickly... In, in more of a traditional environment. Uh, it's, a, it's a tool that I'll be using in my toolbox for quite a while. Thanks again, and uh, enjoy uh, Skybox V2.